Activists in Wisconsin feel defeated at the end of the month dedicated to supporting the LGBTQ plus community. Our Catherine Merck shares one Madison leader's fears with this ruling. It is a big loss for us. Sitting in front of the rainbow flag, Steve Starkey is feeling anything but pride for this Supreme Court decision. It institutionalizes um, discrimination against our community. He says the ruling is a defeat for LGBTQ plus people, while others are calling it a win for the First Amendment. Many sellers were say, well, part of my good or service is expression, and it violates my genuinely held beliefs to have to serve you. In Wisconsin, Starkey says there have been both victories and losses for gay rights. This month marked the first time the transgender flag was flown above the Capitol. But Starkey says if a conservative legislature had its way over allies like the governor, it could mean changes in our state. It, it set a precedent. Um, that other states could follow. Starkey says what is ahead for Wisconsin could be harmful for other minority groups besides his own. It, it's a slippery slope. It's very possible for people to say, um, I don't want to serve communities of color um, because of my religious beliefs and use the same argument that they're using um, against the LGBT community to justify that. As Pride Month comes to a close, Starkey is warning his community about the uncertainties ahead for Wisconsin. Now it's like we have to fight those battles all over again. Reporting in Madison, I'm Catherine Merck, News 3 Now.